بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو انادر ویڈیو آن اوریکل ایپیکس اور ٹوڈے آور ٹاپک ایز ریس ڈیٹا سنکرونائزیشن ویڈ لوکل ٹیبل ڈیٹا سنک وٹ ایٹ ایز لیٹ سے فار ایزمپل یو ہیف ایٹ ٹیبل ویڈ ایز اویلیبل یوزنگ ریسٹ فول سرویسز ایٹ ایز ریموٹ سرور and restful services are deployed on that server and you have access to the get service and you can consume this service on your local PC or wherever you are where you have Oracle Apex right so the use cases let's say for example you have for example uh, daily currency rates uh, like forex rates or any other thing inventory or Uh, receivables payables whatever i mean it is a table you want to replicate that to a local table and you want to schedule it as well now there is a possibility that only you want to sync the new records means only addition another way is that you want to even cover or capture the updates as well or every time you want to replace so there are multiple options available in this feature which is available in oracle apex uh, i believe it is available after version 20.1 but you have to check in your version i'm sure it will be available if it is uh, higher than that so today my uh, demo will be in apex.oracle.com and in a cloud instance so i will be syncing from one instance to another instance i will show you different ways what are the constraints and how you can then generate reports or whatever based on this local table which will be auto synced right so let's move to the demo so here are my two instances if you can see on the top this is my source uh, where my table will be there so this is uh, if you see here i have rest enable auto enabled the table so let's say for example i will be pulling data from this table which is on if you see here it is on a cloud instance right to my another instance you call it target or local or whatever right so this is let me come here apex.oracle.com right till now i don't have any table in this instance in the local instance <coughs> to uh, capture this data right so even we will create the table using the same uh, functionality or feature and then we will see how it will be working okay so the first thing is we need the url right so i will go to the amp table here right i will take this one same way you can do by the way in the modules as well if you are here so for example for example this is from here you will take the url right so for this demo i am going to take this amp authentication at the moment Uh, it is not there i have disabled it i have copied this url right full url of the source from where i need data from where i have to copy data from where i have to bring data so i'm just repeating all these things so you will be clearing from where data is coming and where it will be inserted or populated okay now let us move back to our own instance i have just one small dummy application or you can create another application or you can use it within your own application so here i have data sources so just data rest data sources there is no data source at the moment i will create a new one right and i need a name right so i will say remote sync okay and paste nothing else you don't need to type anything else just next and it will automatically parse this url into uh, service url path as well because it took this uh, amp at the in this next right pagination no pagination leave this at the moment next okay authentication required no right 
this is the data which is there it is showing me how it is at the moment right it is not inserted locally it is just showing right and it is telling me to create a data source so i'm straightforward creating it a data source is created till now nothing replicated only a data source is created now this is my definition right this okay now if i want to create a report i can straight forward create a report on this and it should show me the data so let's first create a report infected report right i will say remote table amp okay and here i will say if you see here this is a table source and i need to select rest source right and here it will say remote sync right nothing else create page run okay it is showing me the data from this table now let me show this as well amp data so this is the data over here so let's say for example this is this commission is zero right let me change this to something else 10 right so the commission is 10 let me go to my interactive report and let me hide this link at least because this is taking too much space okay right and then save data uh, save report see this it is showing 10 right but this data is still directly coming from that table i need this data to be available locally in my local table then from there i should be able to generate the report so there should be a schedule taking this data from this remote table inserting into this table or updating in this table and then i should be able to do certain i mean maybe i need some actions on this or whatever maybe it's, uh, i need to create dashboards or some other business intelligence usages there okay so let's come back to this again data sources in my apex.oracle.com and i will be clicking this right <clears throat> manage synchronization on the same on the right side you have this option right now before going to this you need to define a declare assign a primary key because if you need to only insert here it, you don't need it to do it right but if you need to uh, do replace or merge because there are three options available i will show you in a while so first you need to assign let's say amp number is my primary key i will click this or edit it and i will mark it primary key else it will give me error over there so better to do it now right so that's it it is done let me again back to the same screen and i will be clicking this right side data synchronization okay parsing schema yes the same one synchronize to now there's a possibility you are already a, having a table you have already created a table you can use this one or since i don't have this table i will create a new one just for the demo but i'll maybe amp is already there so i will assign here remote amp right this is my table local new table right save wow it is saying does not exist okay you can see the sql from here 
or you can just create table okay table is created is ready for synchronization okay now these are the three options synchronization help, uh, type append append is just it will keep inserting nothing else and then there is a merge option merge option if there is some update over there it will uh, get that change as well so it will update the existing data as well replace is replace so it will totally replace that uh, primary key data or line or row or whatever it is there that's it updated okay <clears throat> now i will be using merge because i want to show you an update over there so this is and then you can schedule here as well so scheduling is let's say for example weekly daily hourly minutely right so here if minute this is interval one minute uh, every, every five uh, one minute it will uh, replicate or five minutes whatever you i will just do manually okay merge nothing else right and save and run okay let me show you this table at the moment remote m data there is no data at the moment in this table right r if i will click this one it will show me data from that remote table still this report is bringing data directly from my remote server later we will change this as well by the way okay save and run it says changes applied rest synchronization triggered right now you can view this log it says three seconds ago duration 14 rows right are processed so refresh okay this is how now it is sync now for example on the remote server this commission i'm going to update right or any other column it's not just uh, commission i'm just giving this example so i will make it 9999 okay and save now if you will come here in this report it will show the change right but if you will come here it is not changed because we haven't scheduled right the synchronization if we have scheduled after that time if it is synced then it will show this change but this report since it is bringing data from there it is live so it will show you now let me save and run again done right it is processing job status success right now let me refresh this okay it is double nine double nine done now we need this report to take data from the local table i will click this interactive report and if you see here let me bring bit on this side this is if you see here rest source right this is remote sync page items to submit if there is any parameter or anything rest synchronization use local table right local post processing if there is anything you have to do after processing but now i have selected use local table that means now it will not bring from the remote instance saved let us refresh now i will show you now i am going to change this double nine double nine here okay i will be making it triple one now on remote instance got changed right or deleted any row or whatever the, the change so this is done now i am going here this 
still same old right because local table not yet synced and this report which is IR interactive report it is also not synced strange right because now this report is taking data from my local table which is synced now I am going to sync it so both should be updated uh, I need to go to shared components this manage synchronization and from here and it will show you the log as well right the past what happened again let me run it okay now in the table local table got updated triple one and now in this report which is interactive report it should be triple one that means it is taking data from the local table right another test on the uh, remote this uh, table let me add one row as well I will take some data so amp number let's say for example uh, 9999 9, 9, 9. okay amp name Skandar job um, A and A, you are same I am just putting over there manager I am putting something 7839 for example 7839 salary 5555 commission one two three department ten I don't know which department is this create okay so now if you see here this row is there but if I will refresh here still this row will not be there and we are using merge option again save running done success now I can refresh this report okay Skandar is there with other details and in this table it is also there okay okay I think I have covered uh, the synchronization part with the local tables and with different scenarios now you can test try and uh, use these features and share your feedback if these were of any help or you need any further details about this feature right thank you very much and Allah Hafiz